Welcome to Worldwide Broadcast Corporation, WWBC. Trust the experts at WWBC. Don't leave it to chance. Uh, I've been asked about the need for lawyers. Do you have to have a lawyer to start a business? Uh, that's not an area that I generally practice. Uh, I have practiced in that area, but uh, I can't sit here and say that a person does not need a lawyer. Um, I know that a person does not have to have a lawyer to fill out an articles of incorporation to start a corporation. It's a, it's a form and it's a, a form where the legalities are generally set up on it so you don't, there's no lawyering there for a lawyer to do. Um, and to get a, a, a a tax ID number, again, that's not something that you need a lawyer to, get, to go get for you. Uh, you can do those things on your own, but I'm not, I don't want anyone to get the impression that they should not consult with a lawyer when starting a business because there are a lot of legalities involved in the general picture. But just to fill out the forms and get that corporation going, You don't need a lawyer for that. You don't have to have, there's no legal requirement that you have a lawyer for that, but it is highly recommended, highly recommended that if you're planning on starting a business that you should see a lawyer first. Just like I tell home buyers that before they enter into a contract, even though they've been told that that contract is simple, that contract is still a legal form, you don't technically have to have a lawyer to sign it but it is a legal document and it has legalities about it, you should see a lawyer. And the same thing about starting a business or starting a corporation, while you, it's not a, a legal technicality that you have a lawyer with you as you sign your name on an Articles of Incorporation or as you fill it out. However, it, it is highly recommended that you talk to a lawyer about owning a business, starting a business, and what the legalities and the liabilities and other things that lawyers talk about are involved and you should consult a lawyer to do those things. If an individual or individuals have successfully started a business and that business is viable and is producing whatever it is you wanted the business to produce, it is highly recommended that you have a lawyer on retainer, or at least someone you can consult with even if you have to pay them hourly to do so, but that is most important. There are many individuals who just start a corporation that are not aware of the requirements to keep it in good standing. There are certain things, for instance, in the state of Illinois that you have to maintain your corporation in good standing. There are certain things you have to do to maintain it in good standing, and that's something that a lawyer can strongly assist you with, helping you maintain what is necessary to keep your corporation viable and to keep it in good standing. Uh, for instance, there are certain, uh, certain corporations require um, corporate meetings and the production of corporate minutes, uh, requiring different types of issuance of stock, Uh, Those all are legal issues that a lawyer can assist a a company owner, a business owner with. And for those reasons, as well as liabilities, contract negotiations, uh, just putting together deals, those are areas that it is highly um, advisable that you consult with the lawyer so that you can maintain your business or corporation correctly.